email marketing automation, get response automation tutorial. Hi guys, for today's tutorial, I will show you a step-by-step -step on how you can create your own email marketing with GetResponse. So without further ado, let's get into it. So first, you need to log into your account. And if you don't have an account yet, then you can just sign up for free. You can get forever account and try all the features for 30 days, no credit card needed. So just click the link in the description below to sign up for free. So once you log in, so you can just go here because we need to first create a workflow for our email marketing. So under your tools, you can go to automation and you can find the workflow here. But there is a different way also to create your own workflow more easier. So you just need to go here in your quick actions and then go to edit widget and then just check this create workflow so that next time you create your own workflow, you can easily have it here. So as you can see, so let's click the create workflow. All right, so here is our template here. And by the way, this workflow will be the step-by-step -step process of your email marketing. For example, when your target customer subscribe to your newsletter, you will automatically send an email. For example, a welcome email, and after the welcome email, they will also receive the next step email, and then the promotional email, the discount email, or the free shipping email, something like that. It's a step-by-step -step on how you send email automatically to your target customers once they sign up or subscribe to your newsletter so for example here we have different template to choose from but you can also build your own workflow from scratch you just need to click start now over here but for today's tutorial i will be using this one simple welcome message just to show you the workflow so let's just wait for the load to finish all right so we have here our workflow so this is a short workflow so as you can see here, we have the subscribe. So once the customer is subscribed, then we will automatically send the email marketing like the welcome email or the promotional email depends on you. And also you can add different um, elements here, down here to add in your workflow. For example, let me choose this one. Once we submit the welcome email, if they will open it, then this is the next step. So you can just drug and then just drop it here and then you can just connect this one so here it is so as you can see here we have another workflow so this is how you can do it and uh, that's how you can create your workflow so once you have your workflow then you can start building or creating your email marketing so just click here select a message to send so here you can create a new message or email so just click on it. Alright, and here is the first step for our email. So first we need to title the automation message. So let's go ahead and type here, welcome. So, Alright, and then we have our from email here, the email that we will be using as the from or recipient. And then we have an email here if you want to use a different email to receive a response from your customer then you can also do it here you can change this email over here and then we need to also add a subject line so for example we will be typing here here is the next step after that one we can also design our content so we can design the message over here. Just click this design message and then you will be redirected to this page where you can choose a template here for your email design. So you have a different design here to choose from, but you can also create your own. So if you already created your own design, you can also save it as your template and you can see it here under your my templates. But for now, I don't have anything here. You also have your blank templates here where you can start creating your own template. 
So they have this different option here for you to start building your own template. So you can choose here from the blank template, two columns, three columns, and one column. So let me just go ahead and go back to the pre-designed template. We will be choosing a template here to use for this tutorial. All right, so for example, this one over here, you can preview this template, by the way, to see what this template looks like. All right, so here it is. So this is our email template. So if you like it, then you can just click this one. All right, and here we can change everything here. You can customize the design. You can add your own logo here. We can um, add our own logo. So you can add image logo that you have here. So as you can see, you have your place here. You just need to click it and then upload your own logo. And then you can also change the text over here. So you can just click it and then change the text. As you can see, we can delete it and we can type it. So you can also change the uh, left and right here, the padding, and also the line spacing, the color of the background, you can also change it. So for example, let's go ahead and make this one orange. So something like that. Let me just go ahead and undo. You have your undo option here. So you can change everything here. So you can change the image also here. You can add your own product here if you like to. And you just need to customize everything here. Add your business information and your products. So let me go ahead and click back here. So here you can also add additional blocks. So for example, we will be adding some information here. So you can also add some blocks here. So just select a basic blocks here and then just drag and drop it to your email design. So for example, I will go ahead and add a button here. So let me just go ahead and drag it and then just drop it here. And we have our button and then you can change the color also of your button, the shape, style, and also the text. And you can add your own URL to attach for this button here. So that's how you can design your email here. And then once you are done, you just need to click next. And with that, here is our design now. It's been added here. And also they have this feature to check if your email message will be sent to the uh, spam or not. So as you can see here, we're good to go. Our email message will not be added to the spam messages. So that's good. And then you can also try to send a test message to your own email to see if everything is correct. And once you're done, you can just click this save and finish and with that we just created our email our welcome email so as you can see here we have our welcome email now so the next step that we will be doing is to set up our properties so down here we have our option run multiple times send only to unique recipient send only during the specific hour so if you have a specific hour then you can just um, turn it on and then select the time that you will automatically send this email to these um, target customers that just subscribe to your newsletter so you can also select the send only to unique recipient if you want to but let me turn it off and that's it so that's how you can create your email marketing automation here and also you can add some information here as well if you like to so once you are done you can just click save and publish and with that we are done we have our email marketing automation added here in our get response so that's how you can create your email marketing automation here by the way to sign up you can click the link in the description below for you to sign up for free and try all the features for 30 days no credit card needed thank you so much for watching